What's up guys, David here, 1212 here, and uh, today I got another deck profile for you. The new Master of Pendulum Structure deck just came out, so I figured, hey, let's do something with it that doesn't involve us having to buy things like that Drago Slayer thing, or Eccentric Archfiend, or other expensive Pendulum cards, and still make a halfway decent deck. So I figured, let's mix it with my UAs. Now before you get kind of crazy and tell me that I'm stupid, remember, uh, the magicians let you get a pendulum scale from what is it like uh, three or two to, to eight so you can pendulum summon all the UAs so it kind of works let's get to it all right guys this is UA pendulums uh, we'll go over the UA ratios first it's a little bare because the pendulum engine is a little big but we got one dunker one blockbacker two rival rebounder Two Mighty Slugger, two UA Perfect Ace, and three Midfielder. Okay, that was the UAs. Now let's do the Pendulums. First, we got three Dragon Pit Magician, three Oaf Dragon Magician, three Wisdom Eye, and two Perform Pell Skull Crobat Joker. And to round off the monsters, we have Double Max C for our draw. For spells, we have one Rota, because we just play Max. Two Signing Deal. I normally play three, but uh, it's kind of a room thing. And because we're not playing as many UAs as we normally do, uh, Signing Deal can be dead if you don't have a UA in hand. So I figured, eh, two is probably a little more appropriate. Three Pendulum Call. This, call, or, uh, <laughs> this card is great. Discard a card. Uh... Add two Magician Pendulum cards to your hand. Awesome. Two Terraformings. We still want to see the spell card. Uh, UA Stadium. Two Power Jersey. I normally play this at one in most of my builds because it is searchable. However, at two, you don't actually have to go looking for it, and this thing does win games. So I've pretty much decided that two is the ideal ratio for this card. And then last but not least, we have three UA Stadium, because you still need this card. And remember, when you Pendulum Summon UAs, this thing will activate and give even your Magicians a 500 attack boost. And then for the traps, it's just the three penalty box, because that's all we do. Um, I'm not going to do extra deck and side deck. Basically, your uh, um, extra deck is just going to be a bunch of rank 4 and rank 7s, uh, maybe one Volcasaurus and one... Uh, Utopia Beyond, or whatever it's called, the one that zeroes out everyone's attack, the rank six. Uh, basically, those are the only two that you wouldn't play that are sevens or fours. Um, but, real quick, this is probably one of your best opening hands. Pendulum Call and Penalty Box. Discarding uh, Penalty Box with Pendulum Call is just broke. <laughs> and when you have a what do you call it? A uh, dragon pit and an oaf dragon is your pendulum scales. It's an eight and a two. So you can pendulum summon every one of these guys, which is really kind of cool. Um, benefits of this engine are basically these are extremely consistent, so you always have the ability to pendulum summon. Also, UAs were really weak to uh, normal summon, and then they're like, um, I don't know. Uh, solemn warning you're like oh, okay uh, pass because you can't do anything anymore because once you it's normal summon then you have to swap for I don't know let's say ace in defense mode but you can't because your ace your your midfielder's dead so losing our normal summon for this deck is absolutely awful as well as simply like I don't know I normal summon and then I swap and this thing gets hit with bottomless Ugh, I don't have any monsters anymore well with nowadays with the pendulum scales I could Pendulum Summon a UA Blockbacker, Normal Summon with my UA Stadium, search, I don't know, Ace, and then do one of these, and they both get their attack boost. Let's say I Pendulum Summoned more than this, maybe I Pendulum Summoned a, I don't know, Crobat Joker or something. He also goes up 500, which is really kind of cool. So. Basically what I'm using the Pendulum Summon thing for is a way to alleviate my need for a normal summon. Also, because Rota went down to uh, 
one, we don't always see these guys. That really sucks, and you do still need these to play. So let's say you have this, and uh, I don't know, you opened this or something. You play him, use his effect, he goes to the extra deck, summons this from the deck, and then, or I guess, plays it from the deck, spell, and now you have this in your extra deck, so you could, in theory, now Pendulum summon this thing to the field, uh, play your stadium, and then tribute over it, and get your normal summon search, which would be like probably a midfielder. And if you'd really want to be risky, you could even, I don't know, search uh, Mighty Slugger. Because next turn, you can just Pendulum Summon this thing back and Tribute over it again. So, unless your scales get hit, obviously. But this basically gives us a once per turn uh, Tribute Fodder as well as uh, access to the extra deck, which UAs don't really tend to do very well, as well as just giving you a reliable back row destruction engine through Dragon Pit. Because nothing really craps on UAs like a bunch of set traps on their turn. Ace can negate all the stuff on your opponent's turn, but when it comes time for you to play, if you normal summon something and it just gets hit with Torrential Tribute, you're pretty much, you know, shit out of luck, so it's really nice to, you know, to add this thing back to hand, pop, and kill that. Alright guys, hope you like the deck profile, a little different format. Uh, a couple days I'll have some duels for you. I kind of wanted to break it up, uh, just because, um, I've been a little busy with some things, and... I don't have a lot of time to devote to, like, a, a one big giant video, but I still want to get, like, content out to you guys, so if I figure I could break some stuff up and, you know, make more videos that you guys aren't like, wondering what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> um, so stay tuned for the dual video that will be coming later this week, uh, very soon, actually. Uh, and then next up, I have another deck using the structure deck that's actually really, really fun, too. Uh, that's another mashup, so stay tuned for that. And remember, guys, if you don't troll the meta, who will? I'll see you guys next time.